In addition to the front of the body, bulging rear arches suffer from sandblasting. It is advisable to protect weak points in time with an armor film. In the first years of the Toliati assembly, the accuracy of fitting body elements fluctuated greatly. In many cars, for example, the driver's door and trunk lid were poorly adjusted, it sometimes even rubbed against the bumper. But even in the absence of obvious signs of a poor fit, it is better to paste over the corners of the edges with a protective film at the trunk lid. After all, the bumper in any case plays a significant role when driving at high speeds. It. By the way, this also applies to cars of other brands. Paint quality is mediocre. The layer thickness is sufficient, but the resistance is weak. Chips are formed quickly. With abrasive polishing of the body it is very easy to break through the layer. Sometimes on machines of 2014, there were ridiculous assembly flaws. In some cars, the air conditioning drain pipe was incorrectly laid and water accumulated on the floor and the front passenger's feet, in others, the door trim was installed incorrectly. There is a known case when the assemblers mixed up the brake lines that came up to the ABS unit. Quite often, the dip beam lamps of the daytime running lights burn out. Servicemen have not yet figured out the reasons. Engine. Cars with a 1.2 engine, 75 horsepower, are a rarity in Russia in the first years of sales. This engine was intended exclusively for Sandero in the basic configuration, and then it was completely removed from our market due to the lack of demand for such cars. Accordingly, there is not enough statistical data on how this engine behaved under the hood of Logan. But on Renault models that were delivered to Russia before him, for example, Clio and Symbol, he proved himself well. The time-tested 8-valve 1.6 engine, 82 horsepower, of the K7M series migrated to the second Logan from its predecessor with minor changes. The fresh unit has a different camshaft and converter installed, it was programmed to comply with Euro 5 standards. The rest is the same reliable, indestructible engine. It remains so even after the localization of production in Toliati. The transition to the Euro 5 Eco level significantly strangled the engine, and some owners began to have difficulty with the cold start in the winter. The manufacturer quickly released a fresh firmware, which in most cases eliminated the problem of floating idle speed on an unheated engine. In 2015, Renault revised the engine maintenance regulations, increasing the timing belt replacement intervals from 60 OE0 to 90,000 km. However, the elements of the mechanism have remained the same. Therefore, we recommend that you adhere to the old regulations in order to ensure that problems are avoided. Practice has shown that overrun often leads to a broken belt and a meeting of pistons with valves. This also applies to the 16-valve 1.6 engine with a power of 102 horsepower, designation K4M. The Renault 1.6 engine, 102 horsepower, of the K4M series also did not undergo significant changes compared to the unit from the time of the first loading. This is still a solid motor, albeit with the Russian residence permit. However, it was more capricious than on the younger K7M, the initial firmware for Euro 5 showed itself. Difficulties with cold starting and floating idle are much more common. The updated software released by the manufacturer solved the first problem, but many owners still had trouble with the turnover, although to a lesser extent. In this case, sometimes it helps to replace cracked gaskets in the intake manifold and throttle valve. Due to air leakage, the idle speed either floats or hangs, or spontaneously jump in various modes of motion. On vehicles with a mileage of 100,000 km, the sealing ring of the phase shifter solenoid located on the valve cover begins to leak. Usually, obvious oil fogging is found next to the filler neck. The 1.6 engine, 114 horsepower, of the H4M series, aka HR16DE, became available for Logans in 2015. This time proven timing chain engine has a good reputation. He is known for such Renault Nissan models as Note and Kashke, as well as Fluence. The motor is reliable, it works without repairs for at least 200,000 km. However, it is worth reducing the manufacturer's recommended oil change interval from 15,000 to 10,000 km. In Russian conditions, overrun can provoke the occurrence of oil scraper piston rings after 100,000 km of run as well as reduce the life of the chain, which, with careful operation, requires replacement only during engine overhaul. The Logan and the restyled Duster were initially equipped with the Russian-assembled HR16D engine. Production was localized at a plant in Toliati. To date, no shortcomings of domestic motors have been recorded in comparison with foreign ones. 
Transmission The 4-speed automatic DP2 is a successor to the AL4-DP0 unit, a joint development of the Pugil Citroën and Renault Concerns, which has a mediocre reputation. Manufacturers could not completely cure congenital sores, but still significantly increased the reliability of the box. Automatic DP requires careful handling. He does not like high loads, is very sensitive even to slight overheating and is intended exclusively for urban use. Therefore, we must remember, especially the owner of the Sarbdero stepway crossovers, that the passion for driving on bad roads with frequent slippage significantly reduces the resource of this unit. However, subject to gentle operation and regular, every 60,000 to 80,000 kilometers, oil changes in the unit, it can last up to 200,000 kilometers. One of the undefeated sores of DP is the short life of the solenoids that control the pressure in the hydraulic system of the machine. Their malfunction immediately causes jolts and jerks when shifting gears. Often this happens up to 100,000 kilometers. With such ailments of the machine, it is very important not to postpone a visit to the service, you will lose the chance to get off with a little blood. Usually both solenoids are changed so as not to climb into the unit again soon. At high loads and overheating, the DP machine first of all burns out the clutches, the performance of the cooling system is low. Moreover, in the Logan family, the box is deprived of an additional heat exchanger, which Duster has. And this is another reason to be wary of the Sandero Stepway crossover label. A high-quality overhaul of the DP will cost 80,000 to 100,000 rubles. The JH3 Series 5-speed manual transmission is very reliable and hassle-free. Usually, failures are due to inadequate operation. To extend the life of the unit, servicemen recommend changing the oil in it at least every 100,000 kilometers. The EZR single plate clutch robot is based on the JH3 manual gearbox. This is a joint brainchild of Renault and ZF. The robot was paired exclusively with a 1.6 engine with a power of 82 horsepower. This configuration appeared in mid-2015 and did not last long due to low demand. Due to the small number of cars sold and poor statistics, it is difficult to judge the reliability and sores of the EZR. In fact, this robot is identical to its counterparts from other manufacturers and has similar weaknesses. Usually, the mechanical and control, actuator, parts do not bother the owners, which cannot be said about some algorithms of the box that cause discomfort, and about the low-clutch resource. These are the two main unpleasant features of all single-disc robots. Suspension the only serious sore in the suspension is the low ball resource in the front levers. Often they do not even overcome 50,000 kilometers. Ball joints cannot be changed separately, so you have to buy levers as an assembly. Luckily, they cost quite reasonable money. The sore that migrated from the first Logan is weak steering tips. Often they have to be changed at a run of up to 50,000 kilometers. Tie rods usually last twice as long steering is otherwise no problem malfunctions of the power steering pump and steering gear, racks, are a rarity. Front and rear shock absorbers last a long time. Interestingly, the shock absorbers and springs from the first generation machines are suitable for the second generation Logan. These elements are different, but freely stand on the seats. Some owners resort to such a replacement. Brake system. According to the servicemen, the original front brake pads have an unnecessarily harsh composition, and they quickly wear down the discs. Therefore, it is often necessary to change both consumables at the same time. Weak spots. Schroes anthers often fog up and leak. Even if the resulting fogging stops progressing, this does not mean that you can forget about it. If the cause is not eliminated in time and the lubricant is not replenished, it will be necessary to change the corresponding CB joint and sometimes the drive assembly. The rear suspension is almost eternal. Salem blocks go for a long time and there is nothing else to break there. Door skins often wipe the door panels down to the metal, producing pockets of corrosion. This is especially true for cars of the first years of production. The steering wheel is subject to the greatest wear in the cabin, and this applies to all versions, regardless of modifications. Many owners have time to update it during the warranty period. Quite quickly overridden and the handle of the manual transmission lever. If you close your eyes to the rapid abrasion of the steering wheel and gear knob, common sores of many cars, and not just the budget segment, Logan's interior is doing well. The quality of finishing materials corresponds to the class of the car, and they retain their presentation for a long time. Salon is not quiet. 
this is the fall of poor sound insulation and highly floating build quality at Apto BAZ in the early years of production. Crickets. There were much fewer questions for the first generation Logans assembled at Optoframos in Moscow, now Renault Russia. Outcome. Logan occupies a special niche in the segment of B-Class cars. Apart from representatives of the domestic auto industry, it is the most budgetary player that has no direct competitors. This is a pragmatic choice for buyers who want a simple and cheap, but at the same time reliable car. Therefore, Logan's liquidity in the secondary market is very high. A wide target audience is ready to put up with its frank budget. All modifications of the car are selling well. However, the Sandero hatchback and cars with a robotic box are less in demand by buyers. Russians still prefer sedans or cross versions of hatchbacks and are justifiably wary of versions with a single disc robot. Cars in poor trim levels, without air conditioning and other options also sell poorly. Necessary to create a minimum comfort. The most liquid Logan with a 1.6 engine, 82 horsepower, paired with a manual, in a good configuration. I recommend this version as the most rational purchase. The car most fully reflects the concept of Logan and loses very little in price. You should not consider cars more expensive than 400,000 rubles. Already for this money on the market you can find many more interesting options that will be only a couple of years old. Despite the high liquidity, scammers do not like Logans. However, there are enough taxi cars on the market. Therefore, do not be lazy to fully check the looked after cars and databases. The second generation Renault Logan is comparable to its predecessor in terms of reliability and maintenance costs. It's still a solid reliable car. You will have to put up with some source and the image of a budget car, but its content will not hit your pocket. It is advisable to refrain from buying a car with a machine gun that has clocked up a fair amount of kilometers. And bypass the cars of the first year of production, the quality of their assembly is very floating.